Hi guys and welcome to a new video. Valentine's week will be in around a month, so now is a good time to prepare. So let's start by collecting. First want to shout out my 5 members because they are the people that allow me to keep uploading because otherwise I don't get paid anything because Growtopia YouTube is really dead. So thank you so much for these 5 people. If you want to join the membership squad, it's $1 a month and it supports me so so much. So thank you a lot. You also get cool emojis and cool patches in the comment section so that's something I guess let's start with the first bend all the crystal seeds seems to be sold 1640 that's really nice I by the way dropped all my diamond locks and word locks before this recording 780 here I think I sold the VIP entrances in this bend now it's already at 24, 20, 100 here, and nice. By the way guys, if you want to buy cave blasts, I got a lot of them, almost 500 of them for sale here at the world Geomi, so come here to buy if you want. Now let's move on to my buy plus words. They are all linked in this main hub, that's called HGGH. So first up, buy fun time. 33 here, nice. Then buy Dark Castle Stone Market. 10 here. 11 here. And 57 here, nice. Okay, 10. Time for buy Black Hair Die. 40 here, nice. And 10 buy HGT. Okay, 3 here. So yeah, we got a total of. 27, nice. Now, let's go prepare for the Valentine's event. I by the way sometimes need help with recording, so if you want you can join my Discord server and go to the roles channel. In this channel you can react to this message with a thumbs up if you want to be pinged whenever I need help with a video, so then you can join me. I am going to prepare for Valentine's now. I'm going to buy pepper seeds because I can get a lot of gems that way. During Valentine's gems rise to 500 per word lock. Let's buy some blocks, let's see how many gems we get. So I get 800 gems for 140 pepper, which costed me one word lock. So that is profit during hal during Valentine's because, like I said, gems will be 500 per word lock. So I'm making profit by recycling these. Some people want to buy world and they are asking to ban everyone, but the owner luckily doesn't want to ban me. That one guy is getting really angry because the owner doesn't want to sell the world. This owner has a lot of pepper trees, that's really nice. I'm going to make a lot of profit from this. Okay, this is the last one. Nice, look at that. You can see how much gems I got around. I got around 780. I can actually count this. It's actually 770 because you get around 5.5 gems per pepper. That's around 770 gems for one word lock. I can sell those gems during Valentine's for 500 per word lock or even more if I'm lucky. I found another shop that sells 140 for one. He only has a few though. Okay, that was all he got. Nice, I found some really cheap ones. Okay, I got 800 gems and another 800 gems for a word lock each. I find this situation so funny where there's no punch jammer and everybody is just doing PvP and seeing who can get the items from the vent. It's so funny to me for some reason. 
Okay, next method I'm going to use is to buy a ready pepper farm. You can get a nice amount of profit by just buying the farm, then harvesting the peppers, then recycling them all, and then selling the dirt farm itself is worth like 10 warlocks too. So let me show you how you can profit with this. I'm going to pay 98 for this full farm. Let's check how many trees there are here. So there is 2645 trees. Okay, let's get to harvesting. Right now I have this many gems, let's keep this in mind. I should wear my ring of wisdom for bonus XP. Alright guys, we are done harvesting them, now it's time to recycle them. Let me show you a good technique for this. Basically, you want to recycle only 199, because then it's faster to pick those new pepper trees up. Let's also put on my fastest set. So neon nerves and raptor legs are somewhere. Yeah, let me show you, if I recycle 200, it takes a while until I pick up these other 200, if they are dropped on the same spot. It's better to recycle 199 because then you don't deselect the slot and you can continue recycling faster. Oh, I just got a Blockoli mini tree. I have never gotten this before. It's from my farmer role. I'm farmer level 7 now, so I can get those. It's finally done. I was listening to music while I harvested. So, last trees. Let's count how many gems we got. Okay, so I got a bit over 68,000 gems. And if I count how much that is divided by 500, that is around 136 word locks if I divide that by 500. And I only paid 98 word locks for this word. And on top of that, I also got these seeds and I got the dirt farm. So let's sell those. I get four word locks for these. Well, it's still something. Let's try to sell the dirt farm now. Alright, I found a buyer. What? This guy wants to buy my focused eyes. What? Are you seeing this? I said I sell a dirt farm, he said buy, and then he wants to buy my focused eyes. What is this, man? No, I wanted to donate him. Well, whatever. Because that's clearly a new player, and it's rare to see those around these days. Okay, I think I found a buyer now. This guy wants to buy it. He pays me 9 word blocks. Nice, so let's count how much we made. We spent 98 wordlocks for the dirt farm full of pepper trees. Then we harvested it all and recycled it. So we got 68,500 gems that during Valentine's is worth 137 wordlocks. Then we got the dirt farm which we sold for 9 wordlocks. And then we got some pepper seeds which we sold for 4 wordlocks. So the total profit was 150 wordlocks which was the total of all these minus the price we paid which was 9 98, so we got a total clean profit of 52 world bucks. This is a really good method to prepare for Valentine's. Anyways, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.